What is the carbon pollution rule? Carbon pollution is the major global warming or climate change pollutant. The Environmental Protection Agency recently proposed that new coal-fired power plants have to reduce their carbon pollution by anywhere from 40 to 60 percent. This will reduce the growth in carbon pollution emissions in the United States. We also need limits on carbon pollution from existing power plants. And we hope that once EPA is done with this rule, they'll propose reductions from existing power plants. Why is the rule important? Industrial carbon pollution has been linked to $60 billion worth of damage in the United States due to the global warming that comes from carbon pollution. As the planet warms, we're going to have increased smog, which will lead to more premature deaths, uh, heart attacks, and asthma attacks. In addition, we're going to see tropical diseases in the United States that were never here before. Finally, we are going to have extreme weather events like more severe storms, more drought, more floods, and all of those threaten human lives. We need to reduce carbon pollution from power plants in order to reduce the threat of these impacts of climate change. What are some of the benefits and costs of this rule? EPA's proposed carbon pollution rule would only affect new proposed but unbuilt power plants. It will level the playing field between uh, dirty coal-fired power and new cleaner renewable sources such as wind, solar, and geothermal energy. The benefits of EPA's proposed carbon pollution standard is that it will increase the attractiveness of investment in clean energy, create thousands of clean tech jobs, and reduce the health impacts and costs of global warming. 